Welcome to another edition, Smart Chat, YouTube.com. Do want to do an NHL video for you today. Uh, NHL playoffs coming into full swings. And the um, Phoenix Coyote. Phoenix Coyotes, they fire uh, Maloney. Coyotes fire Maloney. Get it? That rhymes. Citing need for new direction. And the team said that analytics will be a big part of their philosophy going forward. Analytics are killing the game. Gretzky was talking about this um, the other day. It takes away with the creativity of the game. You know, it, it takes the safe bets. But when you look on numbers, numbers on paper can't tell you about the heart or desire for the game. The Maple Leafs, you know, have been using analytics the last few years, how well has that worked out? Maloney put together a decent team for what he had to work with. Um, you know, the point of my example as far as the Maple Leafs is that they were the first to use analytics and have been one of the worst in the league. The plan going forward is using uh, limit analytics that's why they got Lou because uh, Shani said they depend too much on new methods instead of old school using that old school feel a good plan going forward other than Nylander they don't have any pieces They lack goaltending, as far as the Maple Leafs. Defense and many other things. Since Lou came on board with Shanny, things have been moving in the right direction. The point is, is that analytics hurt the game. They pick players, they pick players that are statistically sound, but it doesn't again factor in instincts, smarts, heart will and other things which can make an elite player it can't judge for how a player plays analytics is great for baseball not for hockey like Burke said okay analytics won't tell you if a guy will block a shot with his face good scouting tells you who has heart and Hart wins more games than anything. Hope all is well. Look forward to speaking very, very soon.